Hello and welcome to Skin News. I'm Dr. Joshua Fox, board certified dermatologist and Mohs surgeon at the Miami Center for Dermatology, as well as Oura Dermatology and Cutaneous Surgery. And today we are fired up to talk to you about a quick life hack regarding sunscreen. People often complain about having greasy hands when they apply their sunscreen. So today I'm going to show you a quick trick to avoid having your palms get greasy. And basically it's very simple. Um, this is a zinc sunscreen. I like zinc. And instead of applying it to your palms, you apply it to the back side of your hands, like so. And I'm just going to apply it. And you can see I'm, I'm not using a small amount, I'm using a lot. And I'm going to rub it in with the back of my hands, like so. And it looks like there's a lot on there, right? And But you, you really need that much for it to work. And I'm gonna just sort of rub it in all over. And the backs of our hands are a good place to have the sunscreen because that's where you have a lot of sun exposure. And I'm going to apply the excess to the other back of my hand, like so. And I'm going to just sort of keep rubbing it in, like so, and applying it to the backs of my hands. Notice my palms have nothing on them because they don't get much sun. And I'm just gonna keep doing it, just like so. And see how that just rubs in real nice. And I'm gonna put some on the backs of my hands, the excess again. Now I have a beard, so you'll notice the beard will get some sunscreen on there. And that's okay. But if you don't have a beard, then you won't get any sunscreen on your beard and it'll just rub in even better. So that's pretty much it. You rub it in with the backs of your hands, the excess you put on the backs of your hands where you need the sunscreen anyways. And this is zinc sunscreen, right? People always complain about zinc that, oh, it doesn't rub in. Well, there are a number of products that have zinc sunscreen that rub in just fine. So let's get a closer look here. And it looks pretty rubbed in, except for my beard, which like I said again, is part of having a beard. Well, that's pretty much it. Thanks for tuning in to Skin News. We'll see you again. If you have any questions, please uh, let us know what they are. We'll try to address them. Remember to like and subscribe. Take care and enjoy. Bye-bye.